in this question we want to find the probability that divisor of 10 to the power 99 is a multiple of 10 to the power 96 so basically we need total number of divisors of 10 to the power 9 and out of these total divisors how many are multiples of 10 to the power 96 and that will give us favorable number of ways so from that we can find the probability and before I solve this question, let us understand one important concept that I will use in solving this question and that is the number of ways of selecting none, one, some or all the objects out of a given combination of objects. In other words, we can say we can select any number of objects out of the given objects and we are given that there are k1 number of objects type O1 k2 number of objects of type O2, km number of objects of type OM and remaining objects are distinct because they have one, one, one each. Now if you want to select any number of objects out of these then because these k1 objects of type O1 are identical so it does not matter which one I select so the difference will come only from the number of objects of type O1 that I select. So I can select zero object of type O1, I can select one object, I can select two objects and I can go up to K1. So there are total K1 plus one ways in which I can select object O1. Similarly there are K2 plus one ways in which I can select object K2. There are Km plus one ways in which I can select object OM. Now for objects from OM plus one up to ON we have one each. So for each one of them I will have two options whether I select that or I do not select that. So there are two ways for remaining objects and to select any number of objects out of these objects I'll have to select O1 and O2 and OM and up to on so all these number of ways will be multiplied now with this background let us move to our question so let's first find what will be the total number of divisors of 10 to the power 99 and for that i will have to first find prime factors of 10 to the power 99 and that is very easy prime factorization will be 2 to the power 99 into 5 to the power 99 because 10 has only two factors and they are 2 and 5 so 10 to the power 99 will be equals to 2 to the power 99 into 5 to the power 99 now divisor of 10 to the power 99 can be obtained by selecting any number of prime factors of 10 to the power 99 that is i can select none one sum or all from these prime factors and get a divisor of 10 to the power 99 and because we have 99 number of prime factors 2 so number of ways of selecting will be 99 plus 1 that is 100 in 2 and we have 99 number of factors 5 so that can also be selected in 100 ways so total number of divisors will be equals to 100 into 100 next I find out of these 100 into 100 divisors how many are multiples of 10 to the power 96 for that also first I need to find prime factorization of 10 to the power 96 and that will be equals to 2 to the power 96 into 5 to the power 96 now for any number to be a multiple of 10 to the power 96 2 should at least be repeated 96 times in the prime factorization and 5 also should be repeated at least 96 times in the prime factorization of that number so we will need at least 96 twos and 96 fives so any multiple of 10 to the power 96 can be written as into some other prime factors and because in the divisor of 10 to the power 99 we have only twos and fives and we have already used 96 96 of them so I am left with only 3 2's and I am left with 
three fives. Now to get multiple of 10 to the power 96, I can select any number of twos and fives out of three of each and number of ways of selecting none, one, some or all of these factors will be four into four. So there will be four into four divisors of 10 to the power 99 which will be multiples of 10 to the power 96. So the probability that a divisor of 10 to the power 99 is a multiple of 10 to the power 96 will be 4 into 4 divided by 100 into 100. And here this 4 will cancel 125 times. Same for this 4. So our probability will be equals to 1 divided by 6 to 5. So our option A is correct.